Virgo. Welcome to my channel. We're doing your general love re uh, general <laughs> reading for month of April. Before we start, uh, there is an app down there. Download it. I have a special video that's going to be up there. Um, I'm not getting paid with the app, um, but it is free. So if you guys want to catch special readings over there, do download the app. All right. So let's see. Virgo general reading covering house, house and home. Work, um, money, and finances, health, relationship, um, overall relationship energy, and a crowning, crowning things um, for the month of April. So Virgo, let's see what is crowning you. Okay, Ten of Cups. Wow, Virgo. Nice, 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 nice. Ten of Cups showing here. You know, everything is just up in the air. And if you can see here... It's happy energy, happy days is coming to you this April. Very, very nice energy to be around. Amazing. <laughs> I'm not gonna expound to that, but Ten of Cups is the on point of happiness, all right? Your house situation, temperance, balancing. There can be trouble, yes. There can be a moving out because, it, you know, here it's like a transfer of energy here. So you can be transferring, moving situation, but it's very, very balanced. You're doing it at the right time at the perfect moment. Okay, you're gaining perspective on where you should go or what you need to do with regards to your house, your home. Um, you know, as far as family relationship, everything is just balanced. You know, there's nothing really troubling you right now with regards to your family. Everything is just happy, happy, happy. <laughs> All right, next for work, you have here nine of pentacles. Oh, wow. Someone is taking pride of their work. You know, you've done a good work, Virgo, and you are proud of it. Do all those steps. Okay, this is the hard work that you put in and you're claiming it. It's mine, it's me, I did it, I made it happen. That's how your your work is. Money and finances, you have here, ooh, nine of wands. Um, you may be running on short of money, you may be, because nine of wands is like, you know, putting a lot of effort at the last draw. This warrior is, is wounded, meaning your pocket could have been wounded recently. A lot of expenses has come out and you are basically at the end. However, you know, work is there and, you know, you're going to get out of it. Maybe you just finished paying all the bills and this is how it feels right now. So it drains you out because you pay the bills, you pay the bills, and then it's going to come again. All right. So nine of wands is very, very good because basically this warrior doesn't stop. They will push through to get that money. Okay, and what I'm hearing is the song Money, Money, Money. <laughs> Alright, next for your health. Okay, Ace of Pentacles. Very nice. Okay, very loving, healthy energy that you have. Okay, um, I'm sensing here um, you're starting a new routine. Okay, you can be doing meditation from what I'm seeing here in Ace of Pentacles. Um, you can be enjoying going to parks and nature. Um, this is how you're getting revived, grounding yourself. That's what it's saying for health. Now, relationship. Ooh, relationship, four of swords. Either you're praying for someone to come into your life or you're praying that your partner for once listen to you, okay? You're also in a resting stage, meaning either you're tired of this person or you're tired of the BS. That's one thing. Um, if you're single, you are patiently waiting and letting things come to you. Like, because these are the truths. I feel like these are truth and realities. Uh, the swords is all about, you know, intellect. So there's a truth that you want you you want this person you cut to come clean basically come clean i'll wait that's what i'm looking at it but very very nice energy for your month of um april so if you guys want to get in touch with me you have a link down below my name is al bye